smoke. <laughs> Smoking butt. So we are just checking out some of the comments. I didn't. I haven't looked in the comments or messages for like three years since I got divorced. So like honestly, I. I really don't check these shits. So but now I'm looking at him, right? And he's checking them out. And, he, you know, it's just... It's, just, it's always great entertainment. Or outertainment. Because, of course, we're outertainers. Yeah, yeah, and, definitely. You know what I mean? And, definitely. And before that gets stolen. <laughs> um, but, um, yeah, you know, it's just some things on here. People just get really uncomfortable. And it seems... Oh, man. The truly uncomfortable. This shit is crazy, yeah. but that's the point. That yeah. is the point. Yeah, look, man. look. Got you, got you feeling something, do we? Yeah, the emotion you gets shit something? in motion. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, I... I, I I, my, my first take on it in general, whenever we collab, I feel like people are just afraid because they're afraid of black people. I'm not going to disagree with you there. I'm, I'll say color because you know the first thing they're going to say now is he's not black. Yeah, yeah of course. You know, you know what I mean? Well, black essence or, uh, or African essence. Uh, what? You know, that's what they're going to say yeah, first. Yeah, you know what I mean? But they're really just scared of their own African essence. Yeah, 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 exactly. You know what I mean? I don't know. I think we tap into ours. And, yeah, yeah, exactly. And, and, yeah, it's just some people are avatars and some people are fodder. I guess. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Speaking of that, uh, yeah, some, then one of these dudes, that's what we was going to do. We get sidetracked. But I think one of these dudes said that to you. So, hold on, let me see. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Shout out to, um, what, are we going to say their names? Uh, if you want, man, you can say their names. My I man, mean. Rob Champ, he said, real talk. I like Rob Champ. See, he even got a cool name. He, oh, you're talking about the live rock star. I really don't like giving these dudes any satisfaction. They type whole paragraphs, and I mean, I usually give them. I mean, simplicity is the greatest form of sophistication in my mind. So, I'm I'll be honest with you. I never look at these. I never look at these comments and shit like that. I mean, I do from time to time, I guess. But if I did that all the time, then I probably wouldn't create anything you'd be because, this grown person on the yeah, message board like, like them yeah I'd be like oh wait he thinks this of me or they think that of me cause yeah I'm definitely human you know you don't want motherfuckers um I feel like the comments should be more so like yo what's up how can we get money together and I have that, money to buy that would be me I that would be that, if I left comments yeah. on people's shit like that I'd be like yo what's up man it looked like y'all getting a little money over here I'm trying to get involved but like, I, yeah, but yeah, yeah, and I'm putting things up myself I don't want a boss yeah, I, something yeah. like that. You know what I mean? Anything. You know what I mean? So I feel like that's more so what the comments should be like. Yo, what's up, man? How how did you get to do the things you did, to experience the things you did, or get the things that you got and go places you got to go? Instead of like critiquing it in a way where it's like, I don't know. I just feel like it just comes from a detached perspective of just never having created anything. And um, of course, if you you're gonna hate if you don't create. That's what I feel like. If you don't create, you have no other option but to hate. I think so. I think, my bad, I'm texting this shit, looking sidetracked. Um, yeah, definitely, man. You know what I mean? That's where a lot of it comes from. A lot of it comes from um, um, stagnation. And lack know? of intensity from the stagnation, I think. Yeah, you, you know, know what I mean? So if we see intensity, and, and especially in an African essence form, then it's almost like, turn, turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. So then, like, it's just wild how, like, People would have never, they would have turned a blind eye, and let, but now since I'm, since I look the way I do, some people would digest it now. They would have never digested it, and they feel like there's a yeah, problem. They that's that's their me. problem. They're like, he uses the word nigga a lot and shit. He, we, we, wait a minute, we, you know, wait a minute. Even though my dad I mean, says we'll, it at home. We'll, home. Yeah, even when <laughs> my father says it in, <laughs> in the privacy of our home. But another thing is, is I'm going to get this out of the way right now. For all of y'all, this is gonna hurt. Maybe it's my. I hope it don't hurt my brother. But that's my brother. <laughs> like, like for real, like, like my blood brother. <laughs> like just, just for all you people out there who be like, who is this guy? And you try to always see this. Is what we was talking about in the video, where the hate comes, where you done heard us say this a thousand times. This is the last time I'm gonna say it because we done. It's been a lifetime thing. You know yeah. what I mean? It's the last time I'm going to say it. You can act like it hit you in your fucking head and you didn't we can digest meet somebody it today. at all. We can meet somebody today and they'll act like you didn't say it. They'll, they'll act like it. I didn't say it. Like like I didn't just tell you. Like, 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 like we're trying to be cool. And then at the same time, they have brothers and sisters and act like they don't know what... Like, you know what I mean? Like, like when you say it, it's so yeah. foreign to them. Yeah. I guess because y'all all look alike. Maybe y'all all came from the same 
mother and father or what I, I don't that's know why be something killing like that. Me. yeah that's why I be killing me maybe that's funny. why you can't get it but that's the truth man like I I don't even know what else to say I don't know what else to say yeah, that's my like brother there's, there's plenty of people out here that have brothers and sisters I know that don't the look like them huh? that be I think it's brothers and sisters out here that don't look like at all and they have both the same parents and everything like it's just you know what I mean so I don't understand why people think that we would have a need to lie and what do I have to? What do I have to lie to you for? You're nobody. <laughs> like it, it, it'd be like, like no. They'd be like, oh, your friend. I'm like, no, nah, it's my brother. And now I'm crazy for correcting you, which is ridiculous. Because <laughs> that's like you walking up with your mom and they say, yo, is that your sister or whatever? No, it's my mom. Oh, everybody takes that like to say, oh, okay, all right. She looks young. She looks good. Blah blah. <laughs> whatever. You just don't seem to get it with us for some reason though. Don't want to get it. Just don't want to get it. Don't want to get it. Hate in it. Huh? Don't want, can Hate. Disconnect. Just want to disconnect the grapevine as much as possible. Oh man. All right. With that said, yeah, we're gonna get to some of these comments and shit. All right. Um, I mean, mainly. I I'm think not gonna say your names, man. I'm not giving you no pub like that. I'm only giving niggas pub that got that saying you know positive shit. Man. If you ain't saying positive shit, I'm not giving you no pub. I mean, it's not like I'm. Yeah, but it's not like I'm scared of you. But the, of, of that or nothing like that. I'm just not giving you no pub. You just not getting that off me. You gonna have to grind and yeah. that's it. Yeah, and I just feel like, you know, it, it's just wild, man. Like how, in general, like, it's a lot of love that be peppered with the hate, and then you expect me to act like that hate ain't all peppered all up in the love, like. You know I mean? <laughs> like, like I can't see it. Yeah, like you know what I'm saying. Like you obviously season this whole love dish with hatred. Yeah, like, you know exactly. Like, you know what I mean? I feel like I, I get that shit so much. Where they'd be like, "I'm gonna give you three compliments and I'm gonna shit on you with that fourth statement." So uh, you, you, you you can't say nothing. I gave you the three prior to that. Yeah, you know what I mean. Like it, it, I really right. only gave you those three to shit on you, and I not guess. look like I'm hateful when you really <laughs> shouldn't be giving a fuck and should be creating. <laughs> I, 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 <laughs> but, you're, but you're the bad guy. Yeah, I am. You know Say hello I mean? to the bag. <laughs> I'm definitely that. I don't care what y'all think. Like, I'm that yeah, to you. Yeah, yeah it's like, crazy. You know, you cats out there who got something to say, yeah, I'm that guy. Yeah. You, I'm that dude. Just I because, have no problem with it. Just because you <laughs> yeah, just because you have, like, an intensity in your life because it's like, you know, you're like, might as well be intense and not be, like, uh, stagnated and scavenging and waiting for other people to move your life for you. And that just it bleeds through in the way you talk to people, I guess. And they be like, I tried to shut down all those voices in my life. I can't just click on YouTube and then somebody like that just be talking to me. I've been, I've been trying to shut that muffle that voice inside myself my whole life. You represent way too much in me that I don't. I don't want to even want to tap into. Because that. that's another thing. You think I don't know that? You think I don't know when I walk up to somebody on the street or something like that that I'm looking into a mirror? When you look at a person, you're looking into a mirror. That's what you're doing. So, let's get to it. Cause look, this is a good look. Look, we're gonna read this one. Good exposure therapy, worrying about being judged. Ballin' Boss Peter Thay says, people, no, Ballin', Ballin Boss Peter Thay says, peeps are likely to object in any event, probably projecting as well, and or consciously looking to learn about how they can better respond should someone come at them clowning, like in a way that they're dishing out. Projective clowning is the most hilarious shit us silly creatures do. Laugh out loud. Now, I feel the hate. Don't get me wrong. I, he, think, he thinks he wrote that so... Uh, eloquently. Eloquently that a motherfucker don't know. Uh, that's another thing. No, how, how do you think we do... We can speak. We speak in colloquialisms. You write like for me. You, know, you know what I mean? Like I, I can speak. I just like to play. I just like to have fun. I can speak. If you can do all, I feel like that's more than being able to just do what the textbook way of speaking. Like, you know what I mean? Like if you could, you should be able to have all. Exactly. And my first thought is, you wrote this like trying to look more intellectual than you are. If you ask me, I'm not trying to look. I, you know, I could just tell like. Basic is better. So what's the point? Make a video and, and show us who you are. I don't. People will not make videos. Make a they video will, and they, show us. They who will you not are. make. Take videos. a chance. Take a chance. You you know that's what we're doing right now when we do this, right? A leap of faith. Taking a chance. We know you motherfuckers gonna have everything to say. Examining you. We're gonna talk you. about down to the pimple on my forehead. Nigga. Examining you. You know Examining what I mean? You. And I'm the insecure one? Or I'm the, the one that... Nah. 
No, nah, not really. That's not how I see it. I'm not the most. I'm still human. There's still work I have to do. But you got to take that first step. Make a video. Show us your fat neck. Oh, wait. Now nah, I shouldn't have said that, right? Now I'm projecting or whatever. I don't know. I'm guessing. I don't know why you're not making a video. And, and you should you talk directly to us. I don't have any problem with that. Yeah, yeah. I just feel like most people should. Most of these people don't make videos that, that comment. That they're, they're commentors. You yeah, know, the trolls. You know what I mean? For the most part, and not all of them are trolls. I'm not saying everybody's a troll, but I'm just saying like a lot of the people that will go out of their way to type a paragraph, fucking stanza. Yeah. They need to do something else. Yeah. Anything else, really? I mean, sometimes people will post shit that is like, okay, other viewers will see this and it has value, but I feel like more times than not, when you say in too many words, you. you you're just compensating. You know, I mean, you have your own discomfort with the video or something. Just if it's short and sweet, usually that is the way to get the points across. I really don't feel like. I feel like the more words they're using, it's kind of like more room for hate to slip in. Almost like it's wild how people get. I feel like when they be commenting and shit, they be sitting there like, I have to get myself together here. It's almost like another person. They like the digital person they made. Like I'm about to get my shit, all my thoughts put together here, so that when this shit gets put up on the message board, like you know what I mean, like when you should. Like, Oh, yeah. shouldn't be caring, really. Let's get to that. Let's let's look look at this one. You're awesome by yourself. Jesus Christ, get that nigger out of here. You're awesome by yourself. Why I call you Avatar? You are completely someone else when you're with someone else on your vlogs. This is completely less than your solo rants. You must know what's awesome about you alone. If you feel you need to upload collaborations now, I feel like if I was to stay in one way if I was staying in a box like it, it would just be I would never I would only touch a certain type of uh, audience anyway it would be no expansion it would be stagnation <laughs> so like I just feel like uh, why would I why would see I don't know like the first of all I feel like in reality they want to they love to call me an avatar and all these things and Jesus and these things. But they don't know, like, you're more athletic, more creative. And I just saw this in my life, like, growing up in my house because you're my brother, right? And I just, you know, all these things, like, they think that just because something come out of me that it ain't necessarily come from the same source out of your mouth. You know what I mean? So it's just be wild how they, they were trying to act like you're the bad guy, but I wouldn't know mad things if I wasn't next to you. So it just, it's funny how people don't know how to, take the tough love and then and on top of it it just be mad insecurity like you shouldn't even be commenting on a message board like you should just be taking the shit for what it's worth and then going and, and creating something on your own you know what I mean really like unless you're just a total consumer it's a good idea uh, that's a good idea <laughs> now if you ask me what he just said he said you're awesome by yourself he called you an avatar did you see the movie Avatar? We're gonna take it to like a basic like a kindergartner basic, level. Yeah, like a basic kindergarten level. Wouldn't you want to be an Avatar? I would love to f tap into my true Avatarian self. These niggas ten feet could run fifty miles an hour, right? Because you used to could do this. Living in the in tree of life in ancient years. Living in the tree of life, great oxygen. The shit was so electric that when they walked, the, the ground lit up. All the plants were like neon and shit like that. Because that's, that's what it was. Years and years and, and years And it probably ago. is some black lady in the middle of the forest still like that. That nobody shit. knows exists. So what you're saying yeah. sounds so crazy to me. And so desensitized. That. It just leads me to believe you have a sausage fingers and you probably have grease on your keyboard keys and you might have just slipped and wrote the wrong thing I could be could, could be, be. this know. is the consumer review report here this is the consumer review report I guess you could say like I have no problem with with the people that that uh, that comment and shit you because it's not really for me I rarely respond it's really for other people to see the shit and they can just joust mentally on digitally if they want I'm not giving that shit really too much energy so um it's really not for us I feel like I feel like the comments are for everyone else and we just 
we accept the, 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 the gift and the curse of vulnerability. And we just create shit. You know what I mean? You got, you got another one? Got one more. We're going to get to the... Uh, see, I can't say certain things I want to say because it's not good for the brand and good for the money. So I, don't worry. I do hold some shit back. If you got to hear everything I would say, then you really wouldn't like me. Yeah, they, I mean, they just they don't. Um, no. Yeah, you already don't. <laughs> yeah. So I should probably just say what I want to say. I watch your videos from time to time since two or three years or so. It is interesting to hear your outlook on things. So thank you for your work. However, I have the urge to tell you, parentheses, for myself and maybe others as well, this focus of yours, this parasite zombie dead energy scavenger stuff, man, have you ever asked yourself, and this is some kind of, have you ever asked yourself if this is some kind of outlet for you? It feels to me this is not simply you being realistic or insightful but you being well, deeply disgusted and angry, really. Also, parentheses, talking the ethics of teaching. In effect, you are using fear, fear tactics on your audience, parentheses, maybe on yourself, too. People, this shit, they be, the Again. way they be typing sometimes, this shit is ridiculous. Yeah. Everybody thinks they're a fucking author. People, as in the human kind of conglomerate or body, soul, mind, and social imprint, are complex beings. There are not simply two sorts, creators and vampires, valuable beings and hijacked idiots. Yeah, one love. You say that at the end, though? And it was, yeah. All you're trying to do is, is debate mentally with, with G's. And that's cool, because you know what? I like some of the shit you said. I did. Yeah, and I like some of the shit you said, and you goddamn right. I'd be angry at these fucking scavengers. Wait, hold up. She was asking you, right? Oh, yeah, no, I was just saying, like, <laughs> yeah, I was just saying, like, uh, my response to that was that, or bi he. yeah, binary code is one and zero. You got something, and you got nothing, and that's really about it. You can stack stack up something, or you stay at nothing. Like it really is kind. Of, and I guess you can go in the red. You know what I mean? Go with the Edomites, the ruddies. But I'm just saying, like, as far as um, as far as being disgusted or emoting, giving out emotion. If I was to be monotone in the message, would it ever come across? Would anyone ever gather anything from it? If I didn't apply my own experience, which came with it, it had emotion as, uh, of course, with the experience, sensation, and the experience that I experienced. So for me to bring experience through my voice to someone, I should bring that. Or it would just sound monotone, and there would be no message getting across. You have, I mean, we create energy off of emotion so if I was to instill nothing then I would get nothing and there would be no growth there would be no pushing there would be no pushback there would be no exchange and no one would learn anything and at the same time yeah I get better at articulating what I already knew from an infant that's really what it comes down to is like we just get better at articulating what we already know but yeah, it's just parasites and creators. At the end of the day, it's just parasites and creators, yeah. It's just parasites and creators. People, it, you either gonna make shit happen or watch shit happen. That's really about it. And the whole parasite thing, people don't, again, is duality. It's dualistic in nature even with the parasite. Like, because if you look at anything militarily, if you created a straw man that looked something like where you really keep a valuable thing, say if you have a stash spot that looks like, the, the, a fake stash spot that looks like the real one, and then the fake one gets destroyed, that was a good parasite, you know what I mean, in a sense. Like, if, if people can look at shit in duality, I don't know, I just... They don't. They don't never look at the duality, it's they a two-way street. Everything's a two-way street. Everything's a two-way street. Inhale, exhale. She sounds kind of crazy. She's, she must be, or, see, I keep saying she. It sounds like a she type of, um, uh... Not mentality. I don't know response. Maybe I could be wrong. Could be a dude. Could be a dude. You know what I mean. But all I'm saying is, is what I hear. What I hear that is like the guy that says, "It's all right, Timmy. You just, you just, you, you just have got intestinal worms and they crawled into your brain. I should just be, I should just be cool about that in the nicest way. 
<laughs> no, bitch, pinworms are real. The CDC, 85% of the country got worms. So it's not like I should be like calm, I, calm about the shit. I, like, I, like, I, I like that. I like that that passion. Yeah, like, you know what I'm saying? Anger. I, I, I like that passion. Yeah, if I'd have gave you nothing there, no motion was there, with anything, if I'd have just been like, well, the CDC said that. That's, it, what, she, that's what they wanted. I can't say she. Yeah, I, can't say yeah, she, yeah, I, I, I mean, but that. It's a faceless fucking. I, see, that's what I'm saying. Make a video. Show yourself. Stop yeah. playing. Again, yeah, they like music because of the emotion in the music. You like movies because of the emotion. But now, I guess... Red I'm about to say, not now. Red, 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 you know, it's just a movie. Now it's just something on. Now it's just something on in the background. Yeah. You know what I mean? The energy's low to a point where... Do we like it? Do we know what we're watching? Do we even... Do we have an opinion? I don't know. All, but that was funny. I like that passion. What I was going to say is like, no. It's like, hey, Timmy, you lost the game every game this season... But you had fun, right? You about no. Timmy's going to like. He's going to have fun when he starts progressing, and really tapping into himself, using his body, using his body. You know what I mean? And and seeing what he can get out of it. Colliding with other bodies. Colliding with other energy bodies. You know what I'm saying? Like he he might think that at first because he don't know no better. So if he never so if he, he never might, collabed, how would he be any better? If exactly. He never collaborated. So so they'll say Timmy, um, that's all right. You you went out there and you. You played the game and you, you you lost, but it whatever, blah blah blah. I'm not saying that you don't I'm not saying that you don't learn anything in losing. Matter of fact, it's usually how you become a winner. Yeah. But the point is, is if you don't start from the ground up and tap into okay, well, Timmy might not know how to throw the ball. So he's gotta practice throwing the ball now. That's not where it stops now. What's he got to do now? He's got to even practice how to run. He might have been running, flailing like a little fairy. You know what I'm saying? Now he got to learn how to run. And once you do this and you... Just refining you, the you, body and mind. Yeah, you stretch. Yeah, like, yeah. You, you push it to the limit. Like, So that's fun. That's when you find the real fun. When you find out what you can do. Now, if you have somebody sitting there, like I say, because like, that's what I got out of that paragraph. I got out of that... I mean, it was some good shit in there, but that's the most I got out of the response is like, everybody's made how God made them. Like, no, you are God, so you have to work on you. It's that simple. But see, you might not even believe you are God. See, I know it's a lot of Jewish motherfuckers out there right now that, that it's not even in your makeup. Uh, yeah, yeah. You know, like you're like born atheists and shit like that. Guess what? I hate to tell you, you know, like nah, it's gods and goddesses, avatars and not. Yeah, and I mean like, and you feel like God's not there or not? Niggas, that, look, first, get back to uh, that. Avatar uh, niggas was riding around on flying dragons. I would love to do that. <laughs> I would love to be like, yo, man, I ain't really scared of this flying dragon like that, man. He respects me. I respect him. I'm getting on it. We're gonna fly all around and do all kind of cool shit and breathe in great oxygen and be. 10 feet tall and all this cool shit. Are you kidding me, nigga? Are you kidding me? Calling my man, calling my, my man, calling my brother an avatar was nothing but a compliment, you. Look, I don't want to be derogatory. I want to call you a name. Yeah, I just feel like but that. calling somebody an avatar is a compliment, my nigga. Uh, yeah, but, you know, they just feel like that since you got to be on avatar mode all the time. Yeah, it's like, it's just, I don't know. I, I just feel like you got human experience, you might as well share it. You know what I mean? So it can expand the human, the whole experience, uh, human experience as a whole, and people just won't know if they're sitting at the laptop, commenting on other people's things. So I think that you know, it just comes down to creation. You know, people are not going to really create. They're not going to really put themselves out there and be vulnerable and reap the rewards of vulnerability and deal with what comes with the other side of vulnerability. And you know, it it again, it's all about emotion, generating emotion, and tapping in the emotion that you once had at a time or another or at this present moment and expressing it that's how you release it and then refine the emotion instead of you could just get mad and go blow somebody's head off or blow your own head off but you could refine the emotion and go make a song or make some other shit you know what I mean but people are just like nah I'm gonna go on a message board and attack you that's way better now, you know what I mean so it, it, that's where we at that's where we at and guess what the point of this video was make a video show yourself Stop hiding.